Glenn here with uh, Stand Up Bike Adventures and today we're going to talk about getting an electric conversion for the Crucis kick bike. Alright, so the first thing that we're going to open up here is the Bafang 500 watt 48 volt front hub conversion kit straight from China. After about 18 days of traveling over here, we received this package from Amazon. Link is in the below description. User manual. I love this styrofoam that gets all over the place. It makes a mess out of everything. Let's, let's get rid of this stuff here. Pebbles of uh, corrugated cardboard. So this is the controller box that comes with it. And all the wiring and thumb control. Okay. This unit here must be the controller. Very well packaged. So we've got the nice buffet cables that are all very specific to the motor, nice connectors that are waterproof. We've got the well, front hen lamp, it's supposed to be very bright, and well, this is not too bad in size, the controller for the motor. Alright, let's take a look at the rim for the Crucis, one more box. Ah, here's the display. This display is the C961, basic controls. We're not doing regeneration or anything like that, so this is just a basic control that'll tell you your battery voltage, distance, speed. Looks like it's pretty good quality. It's not too heavy. They say that the motor is about, I think, six or seven pounds. I have to go back to the specifications. The spokes look like they're done well. Hopefully it's all nice and true. They have some nice tape inside the rim, and this is a double wall rim. Some of the cheaper electric motors are single wall, so this is one of the reasons I went with this specific supplier, because it provides a, a good quality rim. All right, so I'm gonna put this aside. So this is the battery that came with it. We bought this as part of the kit. Again, like I said, all the links are below in the Amazon website there. This takes you straight there. It's interesting, this battery of course didn't come from China, it actually came from somewhere in California. It shipped so that both packages kind of arrived at the house at the same time. This must be the charger. So, this is a lithium ion charger. What we bought was the dolphin size battery, and this is the 13 amp hour battery right here. So I believe this weighs, I'm not going to be exact, but uh, I think nine pounds. Feels a little heavier than that. But uh, so the mounting bracket is here, it mounts to a standard water bottle cage, um, charging port here, power on and off. Um, and then there's a key that opens this out so you can take the battery off uh, when. Uh, you're, you know, securing the bike or needing to charge it inside the home. So that's the battery. Um, and then the last item that we bought is this piece here, which is the torque arm, which will be placed on the rear wheel, specifically on the Chris's bike. Conveniently, there is a hole for this piece, which will mount and connect into the motor. And this hole here lines up directly with the uh, bolt, uh, the mounting uh, specific space for the dropouts on the rear wheel. And then your torque arm 